When one or more products in the field experience problems, how fast can your teams respond? With ARIS, visibility from the engineering data to the physical assets in the field to related service and quality information, like these work orders and problem reports, is seamless. We call this the digital thread. One way to view it, using graph navigation and ARIS Innovator, shows every configuration of this robot arm in the field and the applications they fulfill. Using this view, our quality team can see that problems are common in robot arms operating in hot conditions. So they complete a CAPA process that launches engineering change orders to address the issue, and engineering takes it from there. Even the informal collaboration between the quality and engineering teams, here a quick discussion in CAD markup showing the problem area, is part of the digital thread. This change will release new parts for the ECU software, the rotary motor, and the sensor component covering multidisciplinary data and teams. Software items in ARIS Innovator are part of the digital thread too, including links to their source files and external systems, along with connections to other software they depend on or impact throughout the system. But how did engineering figure out what needed to change? The digital thread connects every piece of information related to a part, even the simulation data used to design it. Here, the engineering team ran new simulations using the new, higher operating temperature experienced in the field to discover that the sensor did indeed go out of its acceptable range. So they re-ran the simulation with a new surface treatment for the motor casing to get the results in range for a sensor designed for higher temperatures. And that sensor was found here in the component engineering application and added to the new assembly. Keeping the digital thread connected right through manufacturing, that change will be represented on the production line from here on out. We just include the new part in the manufacturing process plan by dragging it into the MBOM from the EBOM. And this service bulletin can be created in TechDocs in ARIS Innovator with information that's native to the system and associated right here with the part alerting the field that each of the current robot arms running in a hot environment will need to have the new assembly installed to improve its performance. Now, by navigating the digital thread from the engineering part back out to every physical part in the field, we can see across our customers to learn whether or not the service team has made the recommended changes. Here, we can see whether each work order associated with the new parts has been closed or if it remains open. The next demonstration in this series will walk you through the second engineering change order initiated by the quality team, the one that'll help ensure this issue doesn't reoccur in the next generation design of this robot arm.